You're watching EAC News. Thanks for joining us. Prime Minister Hun Sen has asked the anti-corruption unit to investigate the irregularities and fraudulent ownership of land and houses belonging to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. The Prime Minister wrote on his Facebook page on Thursday morning that he had just requested the anti-corruption unit to expedite the fact-finding process surrounding Kung Kwam's involvement in the preparation of fraudulent documents for land and houses owned by the state. He wrote, I urge the anti-corruption unit to immediately investigate any irregularities in the fraudulent use of land titles and houses belonging to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs and to take further legal action as necessary and based on the findings of the research. The Prime Minister confirmed that the land and house that Kung Kwam forged ownership documents for originally belonged to the Ministry of Foreign Affairs. He stressed that this state land and house will not be lost and must be reclaimed by all means in accordance with the legal procedures in force. It should be noted that Kung Kwam's house is currently the headquarters of the Khmer Will Party, located near the Russian embassy in an urban area where land typically costs more than $10,000 per square meter. On Wednesday night, Prime Minister Hun Sen announced that it is time for Kung Kwam to return the house and land before the state takes legal action against him.